This was the scene today at Manly Fieldhouse as the Syracuse community came out to send off both its men's and women's basketball teams to the Final Four. Fans were in attendance to show their support and excitement for what both the teams have accomplished this season. And then we got both the men and the women. That is a big time story, man. This is a major market sports story. State and city representatives, SU head coaches, and players all shared words of thanks and support for the community. There's no second guessers here. There's no naysayers here. Everybody here is for Syracuse University, Syracuse basketball. With Syracuse men's and women's basketball touching the entire community, age ranges at the event were vast. Five. Five. How old are you? Three. Or three. Three. Ben. And I have been watching Syracuse for about 56 years. I've been watching SU basketball since the 1960s, when Dave Bing first came in. With the wide age range in the community and the success of both squads, Linda Irvin sees this as a huge positive, especially for the girls. Because for, for years they've been playing their games with people don't come to see them, you know. But now, I think they've earned the respect of everyone here, and it'll be a different thing going forward. So as Orange Nation sends its teams off, fans old, young, and in between will be thinking one thing. Are they going to win on Saturday? Oh, yeah, and Monday, too. <laughs> James Hadnot, NCC News.